everyone. So today we are going to do the 2020 spring collection live unboxing. I have my husband here. Let's do this, y'all. Um, so yeah, we're going to dig in. There is a few products that I have that are not labeled, so I am not quite sure uh, what the scents are, and as always, I don't know the scent description. I won't know until this video is actually released. So, um, yeah, so let's get started. I did open up the box, um, so this isn't like a real live unboxing like I normally do, um, but I also didn't smell everything, and I also didn't like dig deep into the box, so I'm still going to be just as surprised as you guys are. Okay, so <clears throat> here are all of our new soaps. So I want a, I really wanted him here so he can give me his feedback as well because I smelt a few of the bars already and I'm already in love with one of them. See, I knew this was a setup. <laughs> so... Okay, this is Westeria Lilac. I do know that one. That one, our Westeria Lilac comes back every single year. It is our top seller. So, of course, they had to bring it back. What's that face? <laughs> what am I supposed to be smelling? Westeria Lilac. You want my, like, opinion as to what it smells like? Yeah, what's it smell like? It smells good. <laughs> okay. okay we're I can't give you like an official scent. Like, uh, well, I mean, it reminds yeah, but me of my mother's perfume. Was it this one? What's that? Which one was it? Yeah, it was this one. I'm not sure what this one is, but it's my favorite. It's a new scent, never been released before. I love that, and I'm not sure what it is. I'm sure something in this box is going to match it because obviously we have everything like that. I don't know what it is. The um the soap that's green with the swirls that you had me using. Sugar cane? No. No, the one no, it's like unicorn poop or no, no, this is a brand, brand new one. Like, but there are hints of that in here. Oh, whatever, what, like a raspberry, maybe. No, what was it? I mean, it smells sweet, right? Okay, so it smells sweet, mm -hmm. and then, but it, it, the hints of it are from that, <laughs> that color right there. <laughs> that so, it's like it, it was that color, but you were using it, and it smelled sweet. There's so many. And I was using that too. And it smelled like like a, a, a preponderance of a whole bunch of... Like, like cotton candy and stuff? Yeah, like sweeter flavors. Oh, I don't know. But I really like this one. Whatever this one is. So, when this uh, release, or when this uh, line launches, get this one. <laughs> Whatever this one is. I don't know what it is. Um... This one's definitely lighter of whatever it is. And I can't put my finger on I do smell the shea butter in it because, of course, like mm -hmm. our... But it's got... I mean, obviously, you can smell the shea butter, but I can't really put my finger on what the other scent is. Mm -hmm. You don't know? Okay. Nope. I don't know. So, I'm sure once we dig deeper, and this one is cherries, for sure. That one's cherries. Yeah. That's cherries. So, that's yeah. the black cherry. And I do know that it is black cherry because I saw, oh, blackberry wine. Oh, wait. <laughs> that's, not that's not the same. No, but there was <clears throat> another one. Yeah, black cherry. Okay. So, let's... So, and I think that's all of our actual soap bars. Now, everything else is labeled. So, like, I know what it is. Um, 
So this is blackberry wine. This is, now, we did have the wax melt that came in the little, I don't have any to show you, that, that came in like the little container. Uh, they now started making wax brittle. So you can actually like use the size that you want if you have like an actual like, um, <clears throat> like a wax melter or if you have like little plugins so you can make them the size that you want. I can't smell them through the thing. Whoo! Wow. I can smell that over here. Yeah. That's good though. It's, it's so this is blackberry wine. So what does a wax brittle do? It's a wax melt. Like the yeah, like the little uh, the thing that I have in the living room. That's what I thought. Yeah. But sometimes they come smaller, so that way you can like kind of use as much or as little as you want. This one is, ooh, oh, wait. Ooh. <gasps> Hopeless Romantic is back. Oh. oh okay, can I get over here? Oh my God. <laughs> oh. Ooh. I'm excited. Ooh. No, like, what? Okay, which one is that? Ooh, Falling for You. Let me help you out. Okay. Let me see if I actually fall for you. <laughs> oh my gosh, you're so mini. This one, it's not that bad. <laughs> you like, ooh, it smells so sweet. Ooh. <gasps> oh, that's. That smells so sweet. It reminds me of like. I don't know. For some reason, this scent reminds me of like a beach cottage. <laughs> And I don't know why. Like, it's not beachy at all. It's so good. It's too different. I see. <clears throat> Let's see here. What is it strong? Mm -hmm. Uh, well, it's black. Well, yeah, no, it's definitely black cherry. That's <laughs> that smells like a candy of something. What is that? Oh, it's a candy. I don't know, like a Jolly Ranch. I always say. So. No, I always compare the, it to Jolly Ranchers. No, it's the chocolates with the black cherries. Yes, that's what it is for, like, during Christmas. That's what they smell like, yes. This describes you perfectly. Flower power. Ooh, fun. Ooh, that's a good one. Mmm. Yum, yum. <gasps> It is yum yum. Yum yum. It is yum yum. Oh, that's so good. All right, so this is this is what I thought I married. <laughs> it's called Southern Belle. Oh yeah. <laughs> then I realized you were a Midwestern girl, and I messed up. <laughs> oh. I'm just Rude. playing, y'all. This, yeah, this has hints of this. <laughs> I know this being from Georgia. This is peach. Ooh. <gasps> oh, my goodness. Yeah. Mm, it's got hints of vanilla in it. Oh, Westeria Lilac. Yay. I love Westeria Lilac. That is my go-to. Like, literally, there was one year that... Um, it was like three years ago and they were about to be done with like the spring collection. And I think like the fall collection was coming and I bought, you don't like Wisteria and Lilac? This ain't it. Mm -mm. It's very floral. I love Wisteria and Lilac. That's like, that smells like a, um, it 
the carbo freshener. <laughs> it, it's a clean scent. That's why yeah. I like it. Yeah. yeah that's, oh my that's gosh. Mm. So that's just my personal opinion. It's very, very floral. Very floral. Obviously, Western Lilac is very floral. But I do like Western Lilac because it does remind me of my grandma. Because she used to have Western Lilacs in her yard. Okay, what about these butter bombs? Oh, yeah. We're not going to open these because... Oh, Dreamweaver's new. Desert Blossom's new. Wait. Yeah. Wait, what is this? Oh, we're not even done. Yeah. Hold up. Wait. We got Dreamweaver for the wax. Okay, so we're not going to open up the butter bombs. Okay. Open up yours. Okay. Yes, Chief. Mm -hmm. Man, I did that wrong. <laughs> this one's a this one's very clean. Desert blossom. It's clean. Let me see. <clears throat> it's like I smelt that before. What is that? Smelt it. It's in a perfume. Mmm. It's really good. So this is uh what is it? Desert Blossom. This one smells like it should go on a baby. <laughs> it should go on a baby. Mm -hmm. Ooh. That's like baby powder. Yeah. Like it should go on a baby. It's baby powder and cornstarch. I just put it. Still is them. It's baby powder and something. Yeah, it smells like it should go on a baby. That's good though. Okay, so that's Dreamweaver. All right, so of course, all right, so we got our butter bombs. I think these are the only two that I have. Yeah. There's so much stuff. Okay. So, so. Oh, I I thought there was more. I found another soap. I have to let this one air out. It's been down mixed with all those other scents and now it smells like everything. Okay. Um So, these are our butter bombs and they come in a four pack and they are similar to our let me see, I just saw one. They are similar to our bath bombs, but instead of oils like our bath bombs have, these have um, butters in them. And they don't float, they don't spin, they don't make bubbles like our bath bombs do. These you just stick in the bottom of a bath with hot water so it will activate. And it's really, really good. I don't know. Okay, yeah, these have... These have glitter in them too, just like our um, winter line. They had glitter, so these have glitter in them as well. Yeah, I can't smell through the bags, but so Dream Weaver and Desert Blossom. I don't know if those are the only scents that they are going to come in this year. Um, <clears throat> sometimes I only get like a sample of like what is to come, so um, there is that. Uh, so, of course, like our minis, you already seen that. So, we also have Southern Bell in... That, that one's a really good one. Yeah. Mm, that is a really good one. I like that one. So, we have it in Pump Lotion. Oh, I broke it. No, I didn't. Yes, I did. Uh-oh. Oh, no, I didn't. <laughs> um, so we have it in Southern Bell, Falling for You. This, I love this. I think that's and Dream Weaver. And Dream Weaver. I like all of those. I like in the desert, I like them all. Which I normally can zone in on like what my favorite one is, mm -hmm. and I can't for this one. Okay, oh, that's pretty. So, look how. Gorgeous that is. That is so fun. This is flower power. Does it say? I 
I don't have my glasses on. It has petals on it, but I can't read what the petals are. Can you read that? I don't have my glasses. I think they're downstairs. I believe it says cornflower petals. And... Caladula petals. Yeah. Caladula petals. Okay. So, well... You know what part of flower power. Oh, that's good. That's good. Okay. So, that is just a glycerin soap. Um, it's not our loofahs. Now, these are our loofahs. Um, this is blackberry wine. Mm. So, it's got the loofah embedded in it. It's not um, the shaved ones like we had in our fall collection. And then we have Southern Belle, which that looks so fun. Of course, that's the one. That's definitely peach, for sure. <clears throat> Hopeless Romantic. I love it. So glad that this one's back. I love Hopeless Romantic. Um, What are you digging for? Oh, what is that? Okay, we got Body Butters. He's doing his own thing over there. <clears throat> okay. Took a quick break to kind of organize everything. But he just found something. Grab those. Oh my god. Okay. Our hemp shaving butter is back. Oh my gosh. This, okay. So these. <laughs> so excited. These. Okay, so I got Dream Weaver and Southern Bell. Once again, I don't know if these are going to be the only scents that they come in. That's what I have at the moment. Um, you'll have to just check out my website when this video goes up. Oh my gosh. So, oh my gosh. It's so Holy cow. I'm so excited. So, so excited. Alright. So. <clears throat> so, this is what the shaving butter looks like. And you don't need to use that much. I made that accident before. You literally just need to like put a little bit if you're doing like your legs like do a little bit on the tip of your finger like not that much at all because it spreads a lot and so this little jar will probably last I mean depending on how long you how often you shave your legs or wherever it could maybe last I don't know about two months I still have like the larger jars and I've been using it for six so just to kind of put that in perspective. Like, you don't need that much at all. So, um, okay, so we do have our uh, new, well, they're not new. They're kind of new. Uh, perfume roll-ons. So, we got fall, uh, yeah, Falling for You. Definitely going to be putting that in my personal stash. Uh, we've got Desert Blossom and Dream Weaver. Again, I don't know if it's going to be the only things that will be available in those scents. I'm sure they're going to come out with all of them. Um, <clears throat> okay. He keeps giving me these. I guess this is the one I'm going to do next. Okay. And then we also have whipped body butter in black cherry, desert blossom, blackberry wine, and flower power. Oh, Oops. Um, okay, I want to look at these because they're really, really pretty. So, um, our Westerian Lilac. So, they have the dual color in those. And then this one is Southern Belle. Also has the dual color. Um, Desert Blossom. Well, that's a really pretty blue. I like that. That's like my favorite color. So what is bath icing? 
Bath icing is, it, it's actually a three-in-one product. A lot of our products are multi-use. But this one can be used as a face wash, a shaving cream, or a body wash. Okay. So, uh, ooh, hope it's okay. And of course, it's got the classic blue and purple. And then this is just our regular black cherry. It's got that deep <clears throat> um, red color. And our foaming sugar scrub. Now, if you are not um, familiar with our foaming sugar scrubs, <coughs> um, these are somewhat of a newer product. Um, it is a cleanser, a moisturizer, and exfoliator all in one. So you can just get the job done all in one product. And these are really good if you're like to do quick showers in the morning and you don't feel like doing like all three steps. You can just do it all in one. Um, these are my favorite, especially the Twisted Citrus for the mornings. So this is Western Lilac. It's got like the tie-dye effect. Um... Our black cherry's got the deep um, purple cherry color. And Hopeless Romantic, it's also got the tie-dye with the blue and the purple. Um, ooh, that one's cool. That one reminds me of Rugrats. <laughs> it does. Those are like kind candy. It does, but it reminds me of Rugrats. This one is the Desert Blossom. And, of course, we got our Southern Belle. And these are our regular sugar scrubs. Um, <clears throat> these uh, are still moisturizing and they are um, exfoliating, but they do not have cleansers in them. So we do still recommend that you use a bar of soap or our icing or um, even um, our loofah soaps, whatever. Or actually, I wouldn't use a loofah soap with more exfoliating, but like anything like that. So this is falling for you. Um, flower power. Um, black, blackberry wine and dream weaver. That's a really pretty green. I love that. Oh my gosh. Okay. Um, Oh, lotion bars are back. Well, not really back. They're just going into this new season. Um, if you're not familiar with, let me see, which one do I want to open? This one. Um, if you're not familiar with our lotion bars, they are absolutely incredible. I think I have every single one that we've ever had in existence because I love them that much. And um, they come in these little um, papers. Everything is biodegradable. All of our packaging for these, um, they are TSA friendly. So you can get them through the airport and all of that. And they are travel friendly as well. So <clears throat> you just take them like this. And there is our signature little B in there. Oh my gosh, I love it. And you just rub it in your hand like this really quickly. You get a little bit on your hand and you go like that. You can stick them back in the plastic or just back into the cardboard box if you would like. Um, I've done both and they survived my purse. And if anything survives my purse, that means it's tough. So, um, <laughs> so, I mean, you can keep them in these little travel containers. Um, they're perfect. You just want to make sure that like during like hot, hot months, especially with spring and summer coming around, don't leave them in like your car or anything unless you have like a special container for them. I have also used like... If I was going to leave it somewhere, I would actually, if one of these were empty, I would stick them in here and then you can travel with like that. Um, <clears throat> a lot of our packaging is multi-use as well. I've used our packaging for many things. We got new bath bombs. Yes, we got new bath bombs. This is what I'm excited about. I am. <laughs> okay. Oh, I was talking about me personally. Oh. Because you put them in the water and go psh. <laughs> He does like a bath bomb. Oh, look how pretty. They got flower petals in them. Oh, this is flower power. It's so pretty. Oh, I bet that when it gets into the water, it's going to explode. 
Boom. Boom. Flower power. Then you come out smelling like ruthless. <laughs> or candeluna flowers. I don't know how to pronounce it. We don't know. We don't know. Don't hold us to that. Oh, black cherry. These need to air out some. They've been stuck in that box. So we've got that pretty tie dye. They're so. Oh, I like that one. Um. <clears throat> oh, that one's got. Oh, this one's got the. Uh, it's not glitter, but it's the shimmer. Uh, slim. Similar to what our dragon's blood had in our fall collection. Similar to our unicorn poop. Um, or well, unicorn magic. Now it's unicorn magic. Um, we've had this shimmer on a lot of different things, but it's not glittery. It's shimmer. Um, we got our falling for you with our little, um, sugar sprinkles at the top, which these are really good. They're, they got little moisturizing, moisturizers in them as well. I love that smell. I love falling for you. This that one's a good one. Ooh, Dreamweaver. Okay, this one has the little sprinkles, similar to um, our monkey farts. How they have the sprinkles on them. That's what these are. And then Southern Bell. It's got like that tie dye effect. Are we almost done with them? That's it. Wow. This is the last one. It was Desert Blossom. This one has. A little bit of shimmer in on the top. Um, this is a really good one. Oh, I already did that one. And a hopeless romantic. Um, these look very similar to when they first came out uh, what, three years ago. So I'm excited. Are you excited? Yeah, I'm about to go throw some of these in the tub. <laughs> see what they do. Or oh, or you could try a butter bomb. Just whatever. I don't care. I'm excited. This is a great collection. Like literally all of these scents are brand new besides Hopeless Romantic and Wistery and Lilac. Like literally all of these are brand new and I'm super excited. Oh, did I do I did yeah, I do these? We did, we did these. We did them. Oh, okay. We did everything. That was a lot of stuff. A lot. Um, obviously, this probably isn't everything. Um, <clears throat> but it's when... It's a start. It, it's a big start. <laughs> <laughs> it's a lot of stuff. Um, so, be sure to like and so Well, like and follow my Facebook page. Um, because every time when we have a new release, every, um, season, I do a little special for, um, those that are subscribed to my email list. That kind of has like a first come first serve, like little surprise. So be sure to do that, um, to get all the information and the details for those. Um, be sure to subscribe to this channel, click the notification bell. I'm going to put the little thing either right here or right here wherever in, it ends up i don't know or up here or up here or down here <laughs> or over here i don't know it's gonna be on the screen somewhere <laughs> it's gonna be somewhere around here i don't know um so yeah be sure to do all that um and subscribe to the email list for sure because i have new customer incentives for this year brand new um lots of free goodies just for being subscribed and supporting and all that fun stuff. So, do you have anything to add? What is your favorite, actually? Let's let's do that. What's my favorite? Mm -hmm. No, nah, don't do that to me. What is your favorite? What is my favorite? <clears throat> let's see. I'm a tad bit of a small alky, socially. So, <laughs> I would have to say. The blackberry wine? Yeah. That I is like a good one. I like the blackberry wine. That is a good one. Yeah. The other one, you know, the dream one smells like a baby. I like this one. Yeah. Mm. So, yeah. And I, the Southern Bell was all right. It was just too peachy. <laughs> it's too peachy. Yeah. There's a lot of floral, a lot of fruits, a lot of citrus. Right. Spring. 
Uh, I would have to say that the what was it the desert thingy? Yes, the desert the blossom. Desert blossom this one was is pretty good. So good. I really like this one too. Really, I mean, I really like all of them. Nah, you, nah, nope, can't do that. You can't be like I really like all of them. I do. What was your favorite? My favorite of the new. Yeah. Ooh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's kind of how you did me. Okay, well, since you picked two, I'm going to pick two. All right. Go for it. I would have to say Falling for You, for sure, and Flower Power. Okay. I can respect that. You can respect that. All right. <laughs> and it's your channel. <laughs> okay. So, um, yeah. So, that's it. We're going to take product photos now. So, all right. Bye, guys. Peace.